young actress in a short film, 16 to 17, is... Lacey K. <laughs> so cool. And we talked to her earlier, so I already know yes. that you're a singer-songwriter as well. Yes. Uh-huh. And do you want to talk about your music a little bit? Yeah, sure. Um, my song, I think I said this in, in the interview, my mm-hmm. song, Long Way Home, that was exclusively on Spotify, I think, a week and a half ago, already has like 40,000 plays on Spotify. Amazing. We're doing well in SoundCloud. I think we have like 20,000 on SoundCloud. Wow. YouTube, same thing. Um, and then that's with the DJ Noah Neiman. He's really big in Europe. And um, it was exclusively with Spotify. And we got featured on the Crate Diggers playlist, which is like a huge playlist on Spotify for EDM music. Cool. So we got featured on that. And then it came out on everything else, like iTunes and stuff yesterday. That's so, amazing. Yeah, it's and then doing well. this film that you just won an award for, yeah. the short film, mm-hmm. you did some music for it originally? or you? Yes, I did um, three songs for the film. Um, I believe they're my songs, Running Free, Rejected, and On My Own. Those are three of my songs, yeah, I did for so the So cool. And then if so, if people want to look you up, they can look at Spotify yeah. or SoundCloud, or it's yeah. on like iTunes now, too. Yes, yeah. Amazing, you, can look you me guys. Up there. And then my actual like first debut project EP will be coming out either next month or the month after. I'm just finishing it. It's like one song left. We have um, someone to record a verse, and then we're done. That's amazing. Oh, so yeah. the next award you win is going to be like a Grammy or something. That would be nice. Kind of sounds like it. That would be so nice. I would love that. <laughs> it sounds but, like that's the dream. That's what's yeah. next, right? Yeah. I mean, like this. Like I was. I even said when I went up there, like I don't. I don't do this for awards. I don't live for awards. Yeah. Um, I have to do it because I love it. But I am like super grateful. This is like an awesome oh, of thing. Like I completely. That's am so, so validating grateful. that you're you know you're putting all your time and your passion into something that yeah. you're so good at that you're, yeah. people are recognizing yeah, you for. Yeah, and, and and you sh- you shouldn't do it for the awards. Mm-hmm. If, if that's what it is, then you should give up. Because how many times I done lost? You know. Oh, everyone dies. <laughs> it's like, it is what it is. So you have to you have to love it. And um, the whole point is like my dad taught me something um, that when I was a little kid that I will never forget. He said Tiger Woods won the Masters, right? Tiger mm-hmm. Woods won the Masters. And his whole team, they're like, let's go party. Let's go, you know, do something crazy. Like, you just won the Masters. Yeah. Um, with all these extra awards and stuff. And instead of going and partying, he went back to the golf course and hit 500 balls that night. And the lesson that my dad taught me was he said hard work pays off. And he got there because of all that extra work that he did that the rest did not do. Mm-hmm. So he was always steps ahead. And he said, he said the night of your Grammys, you should go to the studio that night. Like, you should do the same thing. And yeah. that's the whole point. You just got to get back to work and that. Success that success only pushes you to work harder. Yeah. yeah. So you can't be like, oh, it's time to, like, party. Like, you can party a little bit, but... You need to go back to work, you know? Get yeah. ready for the next one. Win more Grammys the next year, you It's know? true, because you love it, and you love doing it, which yeah. is most important. Yeah. That's so cool. Yeah. Congrats. Thank well you. Well deserved. Awesome. Thank you guys for having me. <laughs> of course. Congratulations again, Thank babe. You. Nice meeting you. You too.